Welcome to the UMBC Coach's Corner. This is Steve Levy, Coach Karinji on the eve of the America East Conference semifinals. Uh, you learned on Saturday you're going to play Stony Brook. Uh, certainly a best, uh, a battle-tested team, defending league champions. Uh, give us kind of a preview of what you expect to see Wednesday night at Retriever Soccer Park. Well, I expect a, a very good match. You know, they're a very a veteran team. You know, you give them a lot of credit for how they fought back. Uh, they have a lot of seniors on their team. You know, they're defending champions. So it's a team that knows how to win. And, uh, you know, the last time we played them up there, it was a great game. So I expect the same here. Certainly uh, a lot of history between these two teams in championship play. Uh, the year before UMBC won the championship, lost it up at Stony Brook. Uh, and then the year after, of course, they come down here for the semifinals, and kind of a wild game here on the turf, which you win 3-2. to two. So certainly these teams, no, no strangers to one another when it comes championship time. Well, we both, uh, you know, we've both been fortunate to have uh, some pretty good teams the last couple of years. And, and to Stony Brook's credit, you know, they like to play attractive soccer. So I give them credit. They all play very similar to us. should be a very exciting game. They like to go to goal. So do we, and uh, you know, I, I expect Wednesday night that both teams will play the same way. Talk about uh, this, you had this, this long layoff period where you, you play Binghamton in the final game on October 27th, then you have to wait you know, basically 10 days before your next game. How do you keep the guys emotionally kind of at that right point where they're going to peak on Wednesday? And, and physically, from a playing standpoint, what do you try to do to keep get them peaked for this game? Well, what we try to do is, um, you know, we try to keep our normal schedule. You know, as if we were playing last Wednesday, we did some training. Obviously, with the storm coming in, it affected Monday and Tuesday a little bit. Um, Saturday, we brought them in as if we were playing a game. Friday, we did a pregame. So we're just trying to keep basically the same schedule that we've had throughout the year. We've been playing some really good soccer at the end. Um, you never know, know how well you do because of the layoff. Um, you know, everyone would love to have a bye because it gives you a little bit of time to rest. But on the other hand, when you're playing really good soccer, you like to continue to play. But we sort of kept it on the same uh, routine that if we were playing on Wednesday and it's Saturday. And, and the guys responded rather well in practice. This game might come down to, to mental and physical toughness. You've talked about how tough this team has been all year long. With the expected weather conditions, cold, rain, um, you know, it, it may come down to a battle of wills and toughness. If that comes down to that, I think you probably feel pretty confident about what you, what you guys bring to the table. Yeah, I mean, I feel confident. And I'm sure if you talk to the Stony Brook coach, they feel confident also. You know, you got to give them a lot of credit for what just happened um, in the last game for them. They were down, and with seconds to go, they came back and won the game. And from our standpoint, you know, a couple of weeks ago, we were kind of down on ourselves, and uh, we fought back, and all year long we fought back. This is a group that... Uh, you know, feels really good about how we're playing and, and going into the game. So it's two confident teams, and uh, it could be decided by, you know, a break, really. Coach, best of luck against Stony Brook on Wednesday. Once again, the Retrievers take on the Stony Brook Seawolves. That's Wednesday, 7 o'clock at Retriever Soccer Park. Please be there to help us out. Cheer the Retrievers to another conference championship appearance. This is Steve Levy for Coach's Corner. <laughs>